Hello everyone, and I Kashika welcome you to Shakshanamha. In today's video, we will be doing the topic of Passe Raison. Passe Raison. Now what is Passe Raison? As the name suggests, Raison means recent. Passe Raison means recent past. Recent past, something which happened yesterday is not recent. Something which happened three months back is not recent. Something which happened a year ago is not recent. Something we just happened. For example, two hours back I did something or like 15 minutes ago I did something. This is what we call recent past. Before I actually shift to the conjugation of recent past, past eraser, what are the expressions that will help us to recognize that here in this sentence or at this place we need to use past eraser. For example, you come across a sentence which says, Elia Sankant Minute. It is 50 minutes. So it means Elia with something which just happened. If it says Elia Troa Moa, it is three months. No, it's not Reson. Reson is recent, which just did something. For example, I say, Il, uh, Elia Tronth minute, it is half an hour that we did something, or earlier you know that something happened, then only you will put passe raison. In all the other cases, you will never put passe raison. For that, it's always uh, pass plus que parfait, passe composé, or am parfait. Passe raison will only come with the verbs with the actions that just happened. Now, coming to the topic of conjugation, how do we conjugate passe raison? For the students of class 9th and 10th, passe raison seems to be the easiest conjugation one can ever come across. So what is passe raison? We had understood. Now let's come to the conjugation. For passe raison, all of you need to remember the basic verb which we are doing from probably class 7th or 8th. We call it venir. Venir. Now what is the conjugation of venir? Je viens. Tu viens. Elle vient. Nu veno, vu vene, il el vien. So this is the conjugation of vini. You know this. Now you have to add de in front of the conjugation of vini, followed by the infinitive form of the verb. What is the infinitive form? Infinitive form is any form which is not conjugated. So for example, I have to say I just bought an apple. Sh Via dashete yun pom. Now, why I changed de to de apostrophe? Because the verb is beginning with a vowel. So, whenever a verb begins with a vowel, you change de to de apostrophe. For example, I just gave an exam. Je via de passe yun examen. I just bought a car. Je via dashete yun voiture. So you just did something. Whenever you just did something, it's passe reso. It's very simple. You just have to remember the conjugation of venir followed by de plus the infinitive form of the verb. Now let's take the verb. Mm, now let's take the verb for example, parle. So let's conjugate it in passe reso. Je via de parle. Tu via de parle. Il via de parle. El via de parle. Nu veno de parle. Vu vene de parle. Ils els vien de parle. So these are some examples of the conjugation of, uh, this is the conjugation of parle in passe raison. So passe raison seems to be very simple and a short topic. But in class 9th, you can get question, you can get a fill up related to this tense, you can use this in your letters. And for the students of class 10th, it is always important for the board exam. Uh, at the end of the video, I will be putting some sentences so which you can read and understand the topic better.